when you take your videos from basic to cinematic let's make a smooth wave pan transition in shortcut to show you the example i have these two clips here notice both clips have a camera pan a pan or wave transition works best when you are using panning shots to create this transition first move your playhead to the middle of these two clips then move your playhead 10 frames to the left we will split the clip here hit s on your keyboard to split now move your playhead back to the middle of the two clips and this time move 10 frames to the right we will split the clip here as well next let's add another video track click on these lines and select add video track now we want to place the first clip on the top of the second clip cut this clip move your playhead to the beginning of the clip Select video track 2 and paste your clip there. Select the clip, go to filters, click the plus icon to add a filter. We will add the size, position and rotate effect to our clip. At the beginning of the clip, in the filters panel, click the stopwatch icon to create a keyframe for position and size. Then move your playhead to the end of the clip. Here we want to move our clip to the left side and out of the frame. So for position, enter negative 1920. Since our frame size is 1920 by 1080, this will move it to the left. Now select the bottom clip, click the plus icon to add the effect. We will apply the same effect. Move your play here to the end of the clip. Click the stopwatch icon to create the keyframe. Then move your playhead back to the beginning of the clip. This time we want to move the clip to the right side and out of the frame. So for position, enter 1920. This will move it to the right. It will look like this. Now we'll add blur to both clips to create a motion blur effect. Select the clip. Click the plus icon to add the effect. Search for blur. Choose the box blur effect. Adjust the height and width. Then add the same effect to the bottom clip. And the effect will look like this.